Welcome to Button Mash Theater. My name is Heather, and this is going to be yet another episode of 2064 Read Only Memories. So last time uh, we came to um, uh, this blogger guy's apartment, uh, chasing down that lead uh, having to do with the uh, articles being changed on the mesh net before they're posted. Um, and we had to make a trade to get an umbrella to pull down this uh, fire escape here because we think that perhaps this guy isn't here. Um, so there's nobody to let us in. Let's go ahead and see what we find. Uh... This window is unlocked. Let's go Great. in. Perfect. Oh, what's that smell, Turing? I'm not sure. Oh, no, it's probably dead guy. My olfactory sensors detect chemicals associated with decaying food and something else I can't pin down. Yeah. It's unfamiliar to me. Dead body, probably. That's better. Let's take a look around. Oh, maybe not. What is that old food? An old greasy bag of to and fro, a fast food chain the state is famous for. Uh, flies are circling like vultures. To and fro, that's like in and out. Haha. <laughs> in and out burger. Uh, let's go ahead and talk to it. Touch it. Um, got speakers, we got amp, we got books. There's a Christmas tree. Uh, hello? Mr. Oatska? Yeah, he's dead in that chair. There, that's the bullet hole. Shotaro must be plugged into the mesh. He hasn't even noticed us. I feel like I could scream without him knowing. Ah! Hi! Mr. Otsuka! Nothing. Hello, guest. Hi. Shotaro has been a bit under the weather recently, uh -huh. so he has not been receiving anyone. Okay. He is trying very hard to keep up with his deadlines, but I will check and see if he has a moment to speak with you. Oh, are you going to check checked, now? And he seems busy. Yeah. Is there anything else I might assist you with? A drink, perhaps? How long has your owner been Shotaro ill? has been under the weather for some time, but I could not tell you precisely when. He rarely has visitors or goes on outings, mm -hmm. so this is only slightly abnormal behavior for him. In fact, you are the first visitor he has had in a while. Okay. Several days, in fact. Perhaps you could ask him about it yourself. I will check and see if he has a moment to speak with you. When was your last diagnostic check? I regular check. self checks yeah. and have noticed no irregularities in either my hardware or software. Mm. I appreciate your concern. If you think I am behaving erratically, perhaps you could mention it to should. Is your owner still making blog updates? He is. Shataro is a diligent man. If you are a reader of his work, his next significant piece will be going online tomorrow. I will not spoil it. Now that's that's okay. Very well. Let me know if Yeah, he's definitely dead. For sure. Yeah, he got shot. Yep. We are too late. Yep. Uh how long has he been here? It looks like 
looks like he's been here for a couple of days, maybe a little longer. That means whoever did this did it before we even found out about all of this. Right. Stabbed in the chest, right through the back of the chair. Looks like it severed his carotid artery. I don't want to make any assumptions, but I can't help but wonder if this was done by the same person who assaulted Zin. Yeah, it's possible. Rom doesn't even think anything is wrong. Yep. We need to hurry. If I'm right, everyone we've talked to so far is in more danger than we thought. Someone is following us. We have to find his computer so I can see if I can pull anything relevant off of it. Okay. You interrogate his Rom. Maybe you can find out why it's. Chitaro has been a bit... He is trying very Let's hard... Let's see what we can get out of this That's ROM, okay. then. We'll is there anything else? Um, Chitaro is dead, LJ2. It shut itself down again. Let's see if we can pull some useful information off of Mr. Otsuka's computer. If we can find it. All right, so where's the computer? There's the desk. Got a desk and we got a TV. Ah, the entire desk is the computer. Okay. I'll start downloading these files. Let's start downloading these files. Come on. I finished my examination of Mr. Oak. Gotta find computer. out who's killing all these people. I didn't find anything particularly interesting. But well, I then. copied some files to be examined later. <coughs> cool. If we're all done here, we should hurry and go warn Nanya about what we found. Charlie and Sympathy too. They might be in immediate danger, so we must act fast. Yeah, let's go to Nanya first. Let's head for Nanya's business. Yeah. Leave. Now. Shit! What the hell are you doing back here? Wait, wait, let me guess. You stole some of my files, or hacked my brain, or used telepathy or some shit. Found out someone else got hit by your little ghost in the machine, and when you got there, found out he was deader than New Disco. Uh, yep. That's exactly what happened. That close enough? Uh, it's very close. Um, that is distressingly accurate. Mm hmm Well, it wasn't much of a damned guess. Charlie Nova is dead. Oh, crap. Charlie Nova's dead. What? Charlie is... Ah. Uh... The autocab he was in drove him right off the bridge and into the bay. Oh, the auto cab. Jeez. It's been all over the news for the last ten minutes, and I'm not looking to be next. I'm getting the hell out of Neo SF, and I'm gonna forget that I ever saw you, ever knew Charlie, ever gave a shit about any of this. All right, then. Hell, maybe I'll pick up a new career. I'm less likely to get murdered for being a fry cook. That's for damn sure. Have a good life! Oh, crap. Oh, he's oh, dead no. now, too. No, 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 no! Why is this happening? I don't know. There was no one in that car. No heat signatures, no wireless emissions, nothing. That wasn't even an auto cab. It's a manual. <coughs> the manual car just driving down the street all on its own? How's that even possible? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. That's it. This is too much. I've had enough. I don't care who's controlling the news anymore. Almost everyone we've talked to so far has died, and I can't live with any more blood on my hands. We're not investigating this lead any further. As of right now. Okay, then. Um, it's not our fault, Turing. 
Logically, I know that. Yeah. We haven't set out to harm anyone. Nope. But someone is using us as a stalking horse, hiding behind our investigation to clean up whatever this is. If they want to keep taking out people involved in this, they're going to have to dig them up without our help. We don't have any other leads anyway. Yeah, we don't. Thank you for sticking with me, though. Perhaps Tomcat is finished going through all of the data we found. Perhaps. Let's head back to the apartment for now. Okay. Ah, <sighs> home sweet home again. Such that it is. Mm hmm And before you say anything, I don't feel the need to talk over the events of the day. Too much has happened. Yeah, no kidding. I've already forwarded everything we've rooted out to Tomcat, both Hayden's research and our aborted search into the modified mesh articles. Okay. They said they would be over in the morning to discuss our next steps. I'd suggest that we both get some rest. Sounds good. That's what you want, Turing. Perhaps things will look better in the morning. I hope but so. I have a feeling we're going to be even busier than ever. That's fine. Good night. We'll get it. We'll get it all done. Good night, Turing. Um. Go ahead and get the next day started on the next. Well, it's going to start now. Do, 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 do. Chapter 5. Okay. Made it. Made it to the next chapter. Can I hit escape, like, right now? No, it won't let me. Cool. Rise and shine, you sleepy layabouts. All right. Uh, well, we'll see what Tomcat has to say on the next episode. So thanks for watching.